Hello lovely people, I'm back with my festive Christmas um, holiday season look um, which is going to be full of glitter and just everything glam and beautiful. This is a collaboration with three other YouTubers. Okay, there is Millie Heyer who's doing a festive Christmassy holiday look. There is also, um, she, she's um, um, Australian based. So her looks are brilliant, um, she's brilliant at her eyeliner and I love watching her videos so go check her out, I'll put her in the description. There's also Quinn Noll who's going to be doing a glam Christmas festive holiday look. Um, who Her videos are amazing, she does really good hauls and really good like creative different looks um, and vlogs. Um, the final one I'm doing the collaboration is Shanti Graham who also does really good um, Summer looks, everyday looks, contouring. If you want to learn to contour, go to her page, her channel. I'll link all these people in the description at the bottom for you to go check out and just be, you know, just go check them out. They're really, really good. And I'm really happy to be collaborating with all three of them because they're all lovely people. I've spoke to them all individually and they're super amazing. So I'm going to crack on with my video where I'm going to create my own personal holiday Christmas festival look. To start I apply my Dove Moisturiser which cost me a pound all over my face um, to create a soft and gentle look. Um, it helps smooth my face up before I apply my primer and my foundation. And it also makes your face smell very very nice as well which is an added added bonus. Woohoo! As you can see I'm blending it in now. Okay, so now I'm going to get my primer, which I love to use. It's flawless and it's really soft putting on. Um, it comes out really easily with a pump lid and I'm applying this all over my face to stop blemishes and to even out my skin before I apply my foundation. As you can see now, I've got my W7 HD foundation in the lightest shade. Um, I use this, I apply this by using my foundation brush in all over my face, um, in dabs, at first using my finger all over my cheek, forehead and on the other side as well. I blend this in using my foundation brush which you'll see um, and I like to wear a lot of this because I just feel it blends in really well and it's really really good for my skin. Okay, so this is my Avon foundation mousse to powder and I'm using this just to go over my previous foundation just to set it and to kind of thicken it up and add more coverage as the W7 can be quite patchy and yeah, just double it up a bit more especially for the winter and for this type of look. As you can see I'm going all, all over my forehead, all over my face with the sponge applicator um, and just make sure it's all even and finished. My contour kit from Makeup Revolution, I'm using the contour shade in the centre to contour and highlight underneath my eyes and conceal and stop all red blemishes from appearing. Um, I also put this down my nose as well. Um, onto my forehead and now onto my chin. Um, okay, now I'm using my Get Set foundation um, set. Um, it just helps to stop your face being greasy and it's translucent powder which sets your face for the day ahead, stops it kind of coming off throughout the day. And yeah, it's just really smooth, very easy to apply. I apply this with a big brush and just basically just dust it all over the face. I use my foundation brush um, to apply this just under my eyes because I like to um, just make sure that you know it's it's all soft, all smooth and I like to bake the face. Okay, now I'm doing my eyebrows using my black Technic pencil and I'm doing the corners first as you can see um, and I'm just doing that really gently and smoothly and just make sure that the perfectly neat, as neat as they can be anyway. Um, as you as you will see, I'll be using my light 
shade um, pencil as well just for the inner corners just to stop it looking as fake more kind of natural and kind of like an ombre effect I'm just setting my face with the setting spray um, just just to keep it from moving okay I'm going to be applying my base eyeshadow just using my makeup revolution cosmetics palette and um, this shade is going to be a nice light white cream shade all over the eyelid just to set it all before I apply the color to the crease Okay, so I'm going to be applying a nice brown shade to the creases of my eyes as brown goes really nice with my hair colour and my eye colour. All in the corner and on the basically just where the crease is. applying a bit underneath my eyelid to open up my eyes and create a nice effect okay as you can see I'm going to be getting my glitter copper um, eyeshadow kind of eye glitter and um, using my basic shadow brushes just to apply this on my eyelid Um so I'll be careful with this because it does go everywhere but it's a really nice pretty glittery colour and works really well in this at this season really Okay, I'm going to be applying some of this glitter just underneath my eye um, on the other side on the inner corner corners just to extend my eye and open it up a lot more um, as it, and it looks really really pretty as well and I blend this all in just to stop it being all blocky and to, to give it like a nice smooth transition into the corner of my eye and I just do this with my poofy brush as it works really really well. Um, as you can see now, I go in with the black eyeshadow, only a dab though, um, into the far end corners just to kind of open them up and to give a nice little dark, kind of um, smoky eye type of feel. I'm now going in with my Master Ink Rimmel London or Maybelline, I don't know which one it is. It's the eyeliner and I'm having a nice subtle eyeliner look today. Um, not over dramatic, but a nice long wing and a very subtle line on top. Now I'm going to go in with my mascara, which for this I'm using my collection, um, which I always use. I do double, two or three coats on each eye, just to extend your, extend and exaggerate the eyelash. You can use false eyelashes with this look, but I don't have any on me unfortunately at the moment. Um, as you can see I do my top eyelashes, but my lashes then go back over them again, just for a fuller and more dramatic look. Okay, now I'm going to contour my cheekbones using my Makeup Collection Revolution. Um, it's the palette and it is a lovely nice medium brown shade. Works very well on my skin tone. I do like to apply a lot of this because I do like the contour look. And I like it to be seen. And I like it to help enhance my jaw.
Okay, so now I'm going to give my um, the height of my cheekbones a glow with the Makeup Revolution highlighter. Um, it is broken, but I love it. I love it. Um, it helps you give a nice glowy look and feel on the top of your cheekbones, so you can stand out at Christmas time in the New Year. Okay, so now I'm finally doing my lips, and for this I'm using my Makeup Revolution lip kit with the Makeup Revolution small brush. Um, the lip kit is really, really nice, and it's a nice little, little um, compaction of uh, quite a few colours. I'm going to be using a nice orangey, ready colour, but it's very nude -y. I'm going to use that on my lips, and it will look very, very nice. Okay, so this is my finished look, which has been rushed through for this video. Um, I'm really happy with it. And as I said before, check out the girls I've put in the description. They are absolutely brilliant. I'm looking forward to seeing their videos for the collaboration. And as always, have a beautiful day, night, morning, evening, and stay happy.